So I know I said I wasn't going to do another one until I got to Sonora. But uh, I'm headed to Mono Village. And uh, it's a Saturday. Last night I, I went out to get to Mono Village. And uh, the my GPS kept trying to make me go on um, the freeway to walk. And I wasn't having that, so I was trying to find an alternate route, and I thought I found one. But, um... Mmm. That was really good. Um, I thought I found one, but... Turns out, it dead ends, technically, because... The road goes up into someone's property. I walked for... I don't know, two to two and a half miles for no reason. And then I sat down, took a break, and I let my feet air out. And um, I was looking at it again. And it finally gave me an alternate route. Um, but it'd only do it if I chose Sonora and not Mono Village. And that alternate route is about an hour longer than if I were to just walk across the freeway. <laughs> but I don't want to walk across the freeway because it's dangerous. So, yeah. Um, but I didn't make it to even Mono Village. I was about 40 minutes away from Mono Village. And it was like 6 p.m. And we're going into winter now so it's like 6 p.m it's well past dark it was dark at five you know um i was like looking around the area i was in to see if there's anywhere i could set up a camp no so i kind of resigned myself and i got uh, i got a bunch of leaves off the sidewalk and i uh put them in a pile and i put my tarp over it and i sat there and just huddled up in my jacket and leaned up against my bag and I was like, you know what, I guess I'll just sleep here or try to get some sleep and uh, about an hour or so passes by and that wasn't happening, sleep wasn't happening and then uh, there was a park next to me but it was a it, it wasn't a just walk in public park, like you had to make reservations and like there's baseball fields and whatever but I said, you know what, screw it if I'm going to sleep, I want to be laying down at least, even if I don't have my, even if I can't use my tent. So, I uh, hopped the fence after tossing all my stuff over, and then I just laid out my tarp and blew up my sleeping pad, put that down, put down my sleeping bag, and then uh, laid down, and I crashed right there, and it, went it got down to one degree last night, so it didn't get quite to zero. It probably got to zero maybe briefly. And I'm talking Celsius here. Um, so 32, you know, Fahrenheit. But because I woke up and there was frost everywhere. Um, there was a little bit of frost on my sleeping bag. There was some on the sleeping pad. There was some on the, uh, the tarp. There was some on my backpack. But you know what? I woke up and I was kind of normal. I wasn't warm. But I wasn't like freezing cold or anything. I was just kind of there. So. And I just got up to this, this morning. Um, packed up my stuff. And then I headed onwards down the road I planned to go down. But this road's a shit ton of uphill. I'm hoping eventually it goes downhill because that would be nice. But uh, I had to stop and take a break because I'm, I'm starving. I have no energy. And I'm trying out the peanut butter and honey wrap with the... Uh, the tortilla and it's actually really good so a lot of cars go through here too <laughs> but yeah that's that's my update for now <laughs>